in connection with notice of motion eight. I'm sure you all know who I am from the significant and rather public exposure on this issue in the press and social media. I'm a chartered surveyor. My background is in shops, shopping centres across the United Kingdom. I'm a founding director of the CH1 Chester Bid. Before that, a Renaissance board director. Tonight, I represent a large group of private sector businesses whose collective experience is vast and currently completely underutilised on this project. The current Northgate scheme is the latest iteration of many retail-led schemes on this site and simply it will not work. Not only that, but its existence is killing the city. It won't work because the traditional anchor-led retail scheme is a moribund model. Retail occupier demand has fallen off a cliff, retail rents and capital values have stagnated, shopping patterns and trends have changed permanently. The way that we live, spend our money has changed permanently. We have far too much accessible and better pure retail offers around Chester. So you have the wrong scheme for Northgate. I would venture to suggest it's being led by the wrong people and currently being delivered in an opaque and rather unaccountable manner. We do not need to compete with the current offers in Cambridge, Oxford, Exeter and York. We need to be our own great city. We do not need a retail-led scheme, or indeed any new retail content at all, other than a frontage to Northgate and some sprinkling around the new Civic Square. We already have over 200,000 square feet of a vacant and available retail space that we can't let. And we can't let that because of the spectre of this Northgate scheme hanging over the city. It's sterilising investment. We submitted an open letter on the 18th of April. This had enormous private sector support. That support is growing daily. Please listen to us. I've still yet to get a meeting in the diary, not with the officers. We want to meet with both leaders of the Conservative and Labour groups, and we want to meet with Andrew Davis, your new CEO. We would ask you please to stop playing politics with this project. We ask again, please stop all work on the major retail elements. Please stop all work on the hotel relocation. But do deliver us the market, the multi-screen cinema, and the public civic square. From our own freedom of information requests, you might be interested in knowing that so far you have spent £205,000 with your planning consultants, £280,000 with your project managers, a third of a million pounds with your quantity surveyors. You've spent £34,000 with an agent's letting fees on the House of Fraser deal which is no longer proceeding. And get this, you have spent £1.65 million pounds on Rivington land, your development managers. Most of this money will be wasted. Mr Kenny, your time is up.